In this video, I'll show you how to write complex numbers in exponential form. Question 1 reads, write 5 cosine 180 degrees plus j sine 180 degrees in exponential form. The good thing about this question is that we can easily point out our radius and our angle in this expression. Our radius is 5, it's this number, and our theta is this, 180. That being said, to go from trigonometric form to exponential form, all you have to do is substitute those values into there. However, one thing I want to point out before applying these numbers into our template is that when it comes to exponential form, the angle needs to be in radians. So we need to convert 180 degrees into radians. From past experience, I know 180 degrees is equal to pi radians. So instead of using 180 degrees, I'll simply use pi, where we end up with 5 times e to the power of j pi. In question 2, we're asked to write 3 times e to the power of j2 in trigonometric form, polar, and rectangular form. This question is a little bit more involved. Let's start off by pointing out our radius and our angle. Our radius is 3, and our angle, theta, is 2, or 2 radians. Let's convert 2 radians into degrees. 2 radians times 180 degrees over pi radians. The radians will cancel out the unit where we're left with 2 times 180 divided by pi. Using our calculator, 2 times 180 divided by pi gives us approximately 114 decimal 6. 114 decimal 6 degrees. I know my radius, I know my theta. Now all I have to do is substitute these values into here and into here, then convert the radius and angle to A and B. The easy ones are trick form, where we have 3 bracket cosine of, and let's just round this to 115, just for clarity's sake, plus j times sine of 115. In polar form, we have 3 at an angle of 114 decimal 6 degrees. And in rectangular form, we need to use the following two formulas, where a is equal to r times cosine theta and b is equal to r times sine theta. This one becomes 3 times cosine of 115. b is 3 times sine of 115. Using our calculator, that gives us negative 1.26. Negative 1.26. And this one gives us 3 times sine of 115, 2.71, leaving us with negative 1.26 plus 2.71i or j, however you feel comfortable writing your complex number. And so there you have it, two examples on how to write complex numbers in exponential form and vice versa.